Three, two, one, blast off. Authors, Prabhav Ram, Sheila Pruitt, illustrators, Vidyan Sapani. Twelve dreamy constellations floating in space. A constellation is a group of stars that forms a pattern in the sky. It sometimes looks like a mythological character or an animal if you have a good imagination. Cygnus, Lucerta, Triangulum, Cephas, the Little Dipper, Lynx, Draco, Hercules, the Big Dipper, Scutum, and Orion are names of the constellations on page 2. Eleven shiny satellites up in the sky. A satellite is an object that goes around a planet or a star. Earth has a natural satellite, the moon. Artificial satellites are launched into space for communications, astronomy, and weather studies. <laughs> engineers working on a rocket. Mechanical engineers, electrical engineers, and electronics engineers work together to assemble a rocket. Nine expert scientists calculating the orbit. Scientists figure out what path the satellite will take when it is in space. The path was called orbit. Eight stable planets going around the sun. Four rocky inner planets, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, and four gassy outer planets, Jupiter, Saturn, and Uranus. Neptune make up the eight major planets of our solar system. Pluto used to be the ninth planet, but in 2006, International Astronomical Union, IAU, decided that Pluto was a dwarf planet. Seven icy comets passing through. Comets are large chunks of ice, rock, and gas. They orbit the sun, but are usually far from Earth. As they pass, they leave a trail that looks like a tail. Some famous comets are Hale-Bopp, Haley, Hayakataki, and Shoemaker Levy. Six curious people looking through telescopes. Telescopes help us see objects that are far, far away, like the comets, stars, planets, and moons. Five small dwarf planets hanging around. Dwarf planets are like planets, but they are much smaller, and they do not yet have a clear path around the sun. This means that objects like asteroids and comets litter their path. Pluto, Ceres, Eris, Makimaki, and Haume make up the five recognized dwarf planets of our solar system. Four careful workers fueling the rocket. Just like cars need petrol to run, rockets need fuel to take off and do their job. Rockets can use both liquid fuel and solid fuel. Three skilled astronauts in their spacesuits. Spacesuits protect astronauts in space. Suits have oxygen supplies for astronauts to breathe <sighs> and also water to drink. They prevent astronauts from getting too hot or too cold and keep them safe from space dust. Two eager kids at the Mission Control Center. Mission Control Center is a room where team leaders get together and make sure the launch goes smoothly and everything works as designed till the mission is complete. One roaring rocket ready to soar. A rocket is a self-propelled vehicle that can shoot into space. It is used to launch man-made satellites into space. Blast off. 
Thanks for joining us, guys. And remember that AM and PM story time is for any time of the day, whether you're just waking up, noontime snacking, or bedtime is happening. Stop by and enjoy a book with us.